So when are they due? Middle of next month. Good luck. You need it with twins. Yeah. Our youngest is two and a half. Still a right handful. All right, here's the challenge. Your toddler versus my toddler, and the parent that's still sane at the end is the winner. People do get better, you know. Your mum didn't. Maybe she wasn't much of a fighter. But Patrick is. He'll pull through. You'll see. The thing is, I've already spoken to the a &E consultant on the phone. And? He wasn't very encouraging. What am I going to do, Cat? It's not like I didn't realise something like this would happen one day, but it still doesn't prepare you for it. I'd better go. Well, I'll see you again. Well, obviously I can't take him with me now, so probably, yeah. We can have a proper catch-up. That would be good. So, how's Zoe? It's all right. You don't have to. Don't I? Sometimes it feels like my whole life is ruled by guilt. That means you care. That's why you're a doctor. I should start a support group. Guiltydoctors.org. <laughs> it's really good to see you, Anthony. You too. Send my love to your dad, yeah? I will. Keep him warm at night. <laughs> what did I say? When we get back home, I'm writing a letter to the boss of this place. But you've got a nurse in. I mean, they were just waiting for a bed for him. Whose side are you on? Oh, look, the point is, he didn't come to any help me. Oh, where the hell is Anthony? I know you're angry, all right? But don't take it out on everybody else. And since when did you turn into Mr Reasonable? <sighs> Do you know what? We could be here like this for hours. You can always go and come back later. I mean, I've got the restaurant to open. I mean, it's not as if we're doing any good here, is it? Yeah. Maybe. Kim sends you a love. And I love you too. <laughs> 